Sandra, you're back. Got to run, sorry. Wait, where? I'll be right back. See you at the Spacias. Sometimes I think you are too much like me. Friends, I know you're angry. And you have the right to be. Why do they hide in their houses and not quell the chaos that's come to our hands? Aspasia. Oh, Cassandra. You've returned to Athens. What's left of Athens? The world we've built is crumbling at our feet. Everything hurts. It's as loud as a battlefield out there, and as violent. They're calling for Pericles' head, as though he should know how to handle this catastrophe. No one is prepared for the end of the world. I came to talk to you. I found out some things about my mother. Her name, her ship... Cassandra, it's not the time. Pericles is dying. He won't see me. He won't let Hippocrates in his room. He only babbles about going to his precious Parthenon. Pericles is a strong man. I'm sure he can fight the sickness. You heard the mob. He can't defend himself. He'll die with no glory. Athens has known him a lot longer than they've known this plague. He gave them a voice. His accomplishments will speak for him. <sighs> Pericles needs treatment, and the gods know he won't let me in. He respects you. Could you go to him? I could try. If you do, I will make the time to talk about your mother. For now, he needs your help. It's worth a shot. Sandra. Yes. Come in. It's embarrassing. Someone so strong seeing me like this. I admit, you don't quite look yourself. I don't feel like myself either. I brought your drugs. Ah, yes. It's usually Phoebe who does the delivering. At least I'm alive. Though I can't say the same for my city. It's a shadow of what it was. Well, it will belong to Cleon now. He will have to lift it out of its sorry state. I wish to see it with my own eyes. Come to the balcony. Much has changed. I can't even stand up straight to look death in the eye. You'll recover sooner if you let Hippocrates see you. It's my time. The plague chooses his no favorites. I fear I've failed Athens. Its people... Aspasia? No, you haven't. Ah, you're kind. 
but I've lost. Aspasia needs protection, as does Athens. I thought I gave enough to Athena, but it seems it isn't so. I should be out there, on the streets. You'd be overtaken. There are mobs, and Cleon's doing nothing to calm them. Thank the gods, Cleon won't see me like this. But that's all I can thank the gods for. They've turned on me. It's not the gods' fault. It's the world. It's turned upside down. Athens' fate is decreed. All we can do now is wait. You should go back inside. You need to rest. Where I should be is in the Parthenon. My greatest legacy to Athens. We need the gods' blessing. But Aspasia... Aspasia's right. She often is. But not about this. Yes. I'll go inside. Thank you, Cassandra. Tell my Aspasia I was a good boy and took my drugs. I will. Pericles let me in. He took his drugs without complaint. Thank you. Something wrong? I expected Phoebe back by now. I saw her in the crowds outside. Did you send her somewhere? I had her go to Anastasios to see about a ferry. As soon as Pericles is strong enough, we're leaving Athens. We have to. But now she's missing. I'm sure she's all right. Did Pericles tell you what I said about the cult in Athens? This cult? I thought it was his sickness speaking for him. It's true. But Phoebe's smart. She knows the way back. I hope so. I'm going to look for her. Where is Anastasius' house? It's across from the Odeon of Pericles. Here. It hurts to breathe. Looks like the place. Ella. here Demos must be carrying through on his threat I'm glad Phoebe wasn't here hopefully she's safe this was savage done to send a message Your 
Earth, mother of all, I greet you. Cassandra! Are you all right? I need to speak to Aspasia. We must find Pericles first. He's missing. I don't fucking care! Tell me where Aspasia is! Cassandra! <sighs> I'm sorry, Phoebe. Aspasia went to find Pericles at the Parthenon. She should be there. I think we'd better go with her. I agree, my friend, I agree. There you are, Cassandra. Quickly, Pericles may be inside. What's gotten into you? Phoebe is dead. She's dead because you sent her to do your work! No, I... It's not true. Phoebe wanted to go. She told me she would be all right. And you believe that child? You know Phoebe. She wouldn't have taken no for an answer. It was out of my hands. Out of your hands? You sent her away! You could have protected her! What I asked of her was needed to protect Pericles. She lived to help others, Cassandra. She lived to help you. It's a tragedy. She should be here. Of course she should. But you know the cost of living this life. I do. But did Phoebe? Aspasia, you're here. Any sign of Pericles? If he's here, he's inside praying. He refused to stay safe in the villa. Things have gotten even worse in the Agora. It's madness. Speak later and act now. Pericles? Go!
Pericles! Stay out of my way. All is lost now. He was a great man. Perhaps greater than we even knew. We need to get her out of Athens. We'll take my ship. We have to leave. Don't let him die in vain. Never. to move quickly. Stay close, just in case. Stop! Cleon has ordered that no one leave Athens. And he wants Aspasia brought to him. I'm not going. Leave! Don't let them go! going to stay, Cassandra. What? Why? My work is here. I can't leave the Athenians in the state they're in. You don't need us to protect Aspasia. Leave Athens to us. The city has been taken. This isn't the Athens you used to know. That is why I must stay. We must begin again. <sighs> You're sure? I have lived as an Athenian. And I will die as an Athenian. Then do something for me, both of you. Of course. Retrieve Phoebe's body. Give her a proper burial. Everything she deserves, and more. Thank you. Time to go, Cassandra. Hey! 
And I expect to see you both again, alive. The farther we get from Athens, the quieter it grows, as though it's peaceful. But I know better. I'm sorry, Aspasia, about Pericles and Athens. You have no need to apologize for anything. It feels like I let everyone down. I didn't get to them quick enough. I didn't make the right decisions. It's not your fault. There's no one to blame but the cult of Cosmos. About Phoebe. No, allow me. Phoebe was my responsibility. I should have kept her closer to me. It was a mistake. No, I wanted to apologize. It wasn't your fault. I'm sorry. Yet another murder to the cult's credit. I'll make each of them beg for mercy before I kill them. The time will come. For now, let us look to the future. Do you have a heading? I was hoping you would help me with that. Yes, of course. This woman. Phinecas. Her ship was called Siren Song. Phinecas. Yes, I know the name. Last anyone heard, her ship was docked on the island of Naxos. <sighs> then we go to Naxos to see Phinecas. Volcano? It's pretty hard to miss. Some say there is an entrance to the underworld at the bottom. And what? You enter by diving in it? That's the spirit! A brave Arcadian I once knew had the same idea. And what happened to him? The heat of the flames turned him to ashes before he made the I guess some mistakes just left unexplored. 